Hey everyone, welcome back to Pro Product Comparison. If your internet's been lagging, your Zoom calls freeze mid-sentence, or your PS5 keeps buffering, it might be time for a router upgrade. Today, we're putting two high-performance Wi-Fi 6 routers head-to-head. -head. The TP-Link AXE 75, a tri-band Wi-Fi 6E beast, versus the Netgear Nighthawk RAX 54S, a dual-band Wi-Fi 6 workhorse with premium security features. Let's see which one actually earns a spot in your setup. The TP-Link AXE 75 is a tri-band router, which means it has the standard 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz bands, plus a third 6 GHz Wi-Fi 6E band. It's rated for AXE 5400 speeds, making it great for newer devices and crowded homes. The Netgear RAX 54S is dual-band only, no 6 GHz, but still offers AX 5400 speeds across 2.4 and 5 GHz. Winner! TP-Link AXE 75. More future-proof with that 6 GHz lane for newer phones, laptops, and less interference. The Netgear advertises coverage for up to 2,500 square feet and 25-plus devices. Great for most average-to-large homes. The TP-Link AXE 75 doesn't throw out a specific number, but real-world use shows it competes easily in the same range. Plus, it supports one mesh, so you can expand coverage with TP-Link extenders seamlessly. Draw both handle modern households well, but TP-Link gives you mesh upgrade options if needed. The Netgear RAX 54S includes one year of Netgear armor, which is powered by Bitdefender, nice value if you're concerned about smart home security. The TP-Link comes with Home Shield Basic, which is decent, but the full suite is a paid upgrade. Winner, Netgear RAX 54S out of the box, you're getting stronger security for the first year. Both routers come with standard gigabit ports and an easy app setup, nothing groundbreaking. The TP-Link app feels cleaner and more user-friendly overall, especially if you're setting up a mesh network later. Slight Edge, TP-Link. If you're gaming or streaming in a household with lots of connected devices, the AXE75's tri-band setup can really help split the load and reduce congestion, especially if you have a device that supports Wi-Fi 6E. The RAX54S does well too, but without the third band, you're more likely to run into bottlenecks under heavy load. Winner. TP-Link AXE 75. As of this video, both routers hover in the same price range, around $150 to $180. The Netgear gives you stronger security value out of the box. The TP-Link gives you more future-proofing with that 6 GHz band. Winner, TP-Link AXE 75, especially if you're buying for the long haul. If you want a router that's ready for the next few years of devices, the TP-Link AXE 75 is the smarter pick. Tri-band, Wi-Fi 6E and mesh ready. It's built for speed and growth. But if you want a solid plug-and-play router with premium security baked in, the Netgear RAX 54S is still a solid, dependable choice. Final verdict. TP-Link AXE 75. Hope that helped you decide. Both are great, just depends on what kind of home network you're building. If you want to check them out for yourself, links are down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you're into honest, hype-free tech videos. Catch you in the next one.